So I want to show you how you can use your phone as a transit level. First what you'll need to do is you'll need to get a grade rod. And this one I've just got it clamped onto a fence since there's nobody here right now to hold the grade rod. And uh, the way I'm going to show you how to do this, you'll need somebody to hold it just like you would a regular transit. And then I, what I have here is an old iPhone 6 and it's on a piece of one inch PVC conduit and I will uh, I'll put a link in the description of this aluminum phone holder it's just I wanted something kind of sturdy so I went with one that's uh, aluminum and uh, that clamps so that the phone's on there pretty securely and then there's a rubber stopper it's a one inch rubber stopper so whenever you thread the bolt down the uh, the rubber expands and uh, basically clamps the phone. You can see here, it clamps the phone down into that pole. So basically, now what you have is your phone at a fixed height. All right. And then I am running um, Sight Leveler on this, which is a uh, transit level app that I built, or I designed. And uh, now I will set this up so I can film it and show you how it works. Okay, so I've got the camera set up so that we can uh, video the phone. And I've got the Sight Leveler app running now. And everything is on that post. So what you want to do, I'll show you how this works. When you move your phone from either from left or right or up and down or forward and backward, then the red crosshairs move. So if you line up the red crosshairs, then your phone is essentially square or perpendicular to the grade rod and then you can read the grade rod now we are looking at five and a half inches or I'm sorry five foot five and a half inches is where we're at so from the spot that I'm at right now and I'm about 20 feet away from the grade rod and uh, this is an iPhone 6. If you've got a newer phone, then you can actually zoom in further, and we'll cover that in a later video. But uh, what I want to do now is show you how you can measure the elevation of two spots. And like I said, I'm in one spot, and if I move uphill a bit, um, then we'll take a second measurement. So that first measurement was five foot, five and a half inches. And now we'll come up here. And we'll shoot another line from here. And we'll go ahead and level. Now we're at six foot, eight and a half inches. So we've gone up, what is that, about 18 inches. Um, I only moved about five feet, but there's a little hill here next to me. So I know that uh, over the course of that five feet that there's a change in elevation of 18 inches. And that is how you can use Sight Leveler to measure um, elevation just like you can a transit. So I wanted to show you what I've got uh, for the mount. Like I said, this all goes on a piece of one inch conduit. Um, it's PVC conduit. It costs about $4. And then this is a rubber stopper. Let's see if you can see that or not. I lost the nut. I'll show you. This is what the end of it is. It's a one inch um, stopper, I think is what they're called. And most hardware stores will have them. Um, or you can find one online. I think I'll, I'll find one on Amazon and post a link. But uh, so that rubber goes down into the one inch conduit. And when you tighten the bolt down, um, it expands the rubber and holds the phone securely to the pole. What, the other thing you want to make sure to do is um, pick up some quarter inch bolts because this bolt is probably not quarter inch. Um, you can check it. Chances are it's metric or 3 eighths or something, so 5 sixteenths. So you're going to want to replace that with a quarter inch bolt that's compatible with 
the quarter inch hole on the bottom of most phone uh, mounts or camera equipment. Almost all of them have a quarter 20 thread on the bottoms or on the sides. And this is a uh, Wu Hot, and it's all aluminum, and it's spring loaded. I'll show you here. But it's got this lock. And you're going to want to use that lock because once you get your phone set and start taking readings and you don't want anything moving or it'll throw all your adjustments off or all your readings off. So you want it as securely fastened to the um, PVC rod as possible. And then I just picked up some extra washers as spacers. Where are we here? Here we go. Some extra washers and uh, a bolt that'll fit through here and go in there. But like I said, I'll put some, a link to uh, all of the components and uh, down in the description and if you want you can order through there or you can go over to your local hardware store and pick this stuff up um, right now site levelers only on the iphone and i'm going to be uh, building out the android version if that's something that you're interested in head on over to siteleveler.com and sign up uh, for the email and from there i can let you know whenever the android version is available thanks